Signalis leaves the player dealing with many different emotions and feelings following the end of the game. So naturally, when players think back on their experience and the game in general, one of the first things that they come to mind and that they consider is why couldn't they help Bio? What if we could fix that though? Hey everyone, Christopher Beast here for another issue of Modding Mondays. This is a series where I talk about mods or mod updates that I make or I'm planning on making. So for this week, we don't have any completed mod. Due to some minor hiccups in production of some mods and mod updates, really nothing is in a finished state right now. So instead, I'm going to be covering some concepts that I intend and am working on implementing into a future mod that should be out within the coming weeks. This mod is called Myna Mania, which will add many features relating to the Myna units and Bio. So with no more delay, let's just get right into this. <laughs> So what is Minamania? This mod seeks to add many features regarding the lovable titan-sized motherly replicas. One of the first goals of this mod will be to give Elster a new weapon in her arsenal, because I haven't really seen any weapon mods yet, and I wanted to make one. This new weapon will be none other than the Goliath-sized mining laser. This weapon will let Elster use this giant laser as if it was a shotgun, holding it low in her person and firing off an extremely powerful, high-power laser. This rifle will be achieved by duplicating an existing Myna's rifle from an enemy and attaching it to Alster, and then meddling with its settings to make it function akin to a normal weapon. However, the closest prototype I have on this concept at the moment, I was able to transfix the Myna laser to a shotgun to help with its aiming, but I haven't been able to get more than that to work due to just issues in replicating that prototype. Next feature will have hugs. I've been wanting to start work on a hug mod for a while now, since it's really fucking cute. However, this mod is my first step towards that goal. This mod will add the ability to hug Bio. I intend on having it bound to the dialogue, meaning if you talk to Myna enough, you can hug her. However, really only time will tell if this is achieved for the 1.0 build. This hug will be accomplished in the code by disabling lots of core animation and players to let me control Elster's whims and bodies without it all resetting every second due to the animator and I'm going to need to figure out the code to properly set that up. An alternate solution could be editing the animator itself, however at the moment I really don't know how that could be achieved. This is of all the features in the mod, the one that's closest to being finished, and I'm actually quite near an actual playable hug version of this mod, which is quite funny that this is the first feature I might actually finish. After this mod's completion, probably way down the line, I intend on adding this hug feature to several other different mods and basically making you be able to hug everything in the game, because I think that's really cute. The final work in progress feature for the 1.0 build of this mod will be the addition of healing Bio. This is a must have, Bio is adorable and must be healed. I intend on having this be achieved either by dialogue or by interacting with her in a repair tool. Um, after being healed, she will stand up, give Elster a handshake or something. Uh, I'm really not sure yet, but she's going to clean up that blood. Uh, it's basically going to, what I'm going to do in the code is disable the blood, uh, let her stand up. Those are easy things to code in, and I've actually already have a, a decently working prototype. Um, and this is another one of those features that I can definitely promise with the 1.0 build when I finish the 1.0 build. If I have spare time while working on this mod, I may chain together these three features into one connected string. By this I mean you talk to Bio, you heal Bio, you hug Bio, all together. Most likely going from you talk to Bio, her normal dialogue plays, and then maybe a new dialogue plays and you hug Bio, then you have another new dialogue and then you heal Bio, and then a final new dialogue and she gives you the rifle. This may not occur, but I think it would be rather cool if it did, so it's going to be something I try and work on. So that's what you all have to look forward to and what I'm actively working on. What about beyond there? What are my future plans for this mod? Well, I'd like to add a Myna companion feature that causes Bio to follow you around. Possibly, and I mean possibly, even using her rifle to help you out where she can. And finally, I think a little belt trinket Myna head that you can carry around and talk to like Mimir from God of War would be badass. Though that, that's really far out, so not an immediate focus, can't promise that anytime soon. I just think it would be really badass to be able to go like, oh, hi there, Myna. What do you think of this room? And then Myna's like, oh shit, nowhere smells like ass. Um, but that's all I've really got for you guys today. I wanted to be able to do this just to touch base with everyone, let you guys know what I'm working on in the mod sphere. I'm still here. I'm not out completely. I am on a temporary break from bug fixes 
on my other mods just to work on this and to relax a little bit. Um, but I'm really excited for this project when it's finished. And I'm also excited for the bug fixes on my other mods. If you'd like to talk to other Signalis fans about the lore or just in general or about modding, I have two discords linked below. My main discord VSL, which is where I talk about my personal mods a lot. Uh, and I, I mean, it's kind of inactive a little bit right now, but when it is active, that's what I talk about. And the Signalis on-off discord. This discord is where other modders such as Apneoc and a Aster are both in and they talk about their mods and they're quite cool people. Uh, they're both cool places, and I suggest checking out both of those discords if you have the time. Finally, once again, thank you to Mr. Stelly for supporting my membership. Your contributions help make this series possible. With that, this has been Christopher Beast, and I hope to see you all, well, next time.